Okay, friends, we've arrived. We've finished out the day. I'm going to give today a 7.6, and here's why. Because we did not journal today. I know, I know. I did get everything done. Today's an active recovery day, so we did yoga and we did our walk. I don't know, I think I just would have liked for it to be a more seamless thing. It kind of felt like it was disjointed and I was just like shoving things throughout the day that did not fit well. And I, not journaling also delayed me prepping for the week, kind of planning. Even though, you know, I kind of have, I have tomorrow off. So that's actually what I'll use that time for. And I think that's it. It was just me not factoring in or I don't know, it was just... not prioritizing it so i have not journaled even me saying it right now i'm like oh my god oh my god i might do it i'm gonna see it depends i might do it we're gonna see tomorrow if I, i'll let you know if i did or did not do it but i can definitely feel the effects throughout the day so on our policy agenda break reading the past is present and i just want to read this tiny excerpt about how childhood continues into our adult relationships and it's still discussing transference so the act of like putting someone else's face onto someone else because you haven't worked through how that person's representation or that person's impact in your life and how it causes it to show up in other areas instant anger is often a sign of transference for instance in a childhood in which a boy's every move was scrutinized by his mother his innate need for freedom of movement the a of allowing that is often the dad's role to ensure was ignored and he felt stifled. Now when he is comfortably in his office at home and his wife calls him, what are you doing in there? He hits the ceiling, feeling again that sense of intrusion by a woman. If he has explored his past, he may recognize his extreme reaction as a part of displacement from childhood. If he has not, he will take his anger out on her and blame her rather than taking responsibility for the work he has to do himself. The work is addressing, processing, resolving, integrating, his mother issue i think so it's it's like a nice reminder that part of the reason why mindfulness is so important is it makes it so that you know that the person that you're talking to right now is truly the person that you're talking to and not you know your second grade teacher who called you dumb that one time it's very very important to be aware of how you're doing things how you're moving how you're behaving throughout the world you know, lest you unconsciously hurt someone, or I heard it put beautifully once. Imagine, imagine hurting the person who was sent to heal you. So being aware, being on the lookout, maybe we'll bump the day up to an eight. We did have a very good week, so maybe we'll bump it up to an eight. Definitely opportunities, but it's okay. We're gonna give this an a chance to run again. And I think that's a wrap. That's all that I, ha I have for you guys. I know that these videos are a lot shorter uh but that's okay because they don't need to be longer for the sake of being longer there's gonna be long ones because i might have more to discuss but honestly right now i'm a little bit tired and i'll let you know how planning goes i think it'll, it's important for people to see the planning and the work that's my goal i think this year is just going to be like to show the work i think it's really easy to look at someone on social media and you know make all these arbitrary comparisons and if i could do my part as a creator to just like show the work a little bit more i think it would serve a couple different purposes one helps remove magical thinking so that people aren't thinking oh you know this is happening because you know no but also if someone's interested or wants to learn how to do something or you know maybe i'm able to provide a solution for a problem that they're having or something that they could solve for and then vice versa like i raised you you raise me if there's anything that you have solved and you're like i've got that on lock and she seems to be struggling let me know i'm not going to be offended i am not operating from this mindset of like i'm this know all entity i don't know shit and i'm learning every single day and i think uh that's kind of like my contribution to the collective consciousness is like hey i raise you you raise me so that's all i got for y'all I will see you in the next one.